We just wanted to give a really quick review of our stay at the Grand Marais Municipal Campground. We've been here all week during the 4th of July and it's been such a fantastic experience that we really don't want to leave. This entire town is really fun and um, definitely tourist friendly. So we kind of want to do our top five things that we loved about this campground. Number one, I'd have to say, is Lake Superior right here. It's yep. gorgeous. As you can see, uh, some of our kids are throwing rocks into the lake. There is a plethora skipping of rocks. rocks. They're <laughs> all cobblestone rocks. So there's not really a sand beach, but it's a cobblestone beach, which actually as a parent is cleaner. You don't have sand everywhere. And um, nobody's really going swimming because the temperature of the water right now in early July is 37 degrees. And I heard that it doesn't really get warmer than 40 degrees. So it's fine for putting your feet in or um, there's some kayakers out here right now, sailboats, things like that. But it's so gorgeous and there's rocks to climb on to get out into the water a little bit more. The water is just crystal clear. It's gorgeous. So along with that is that we were able to come in here on a Sunday morning and get a non-reservable site, which, oh, sorry. Are right here right overlooking the water right overlooking the water and um, we were able to have that for five nights yeah. so they have all their sites along the water are not reservable so if you know you're coming in get here early there's actually been people sitting on the steps waiting um, I think the office opens at 8 and our neighbor she was reserving a site for their son um, they got here they started sitting in line at 7 a.m. And they were able to get one, especially during a, a holiday week like we were. So there's the hot tip. They also, it seems like a lot of people come here um, year after year. The neighbors we had next to us, this is like their 50th year of coming here. So obviously that kind of speaks for the campground itself. But they all have a hot tip. They said in July 2nd, when reservations open up, they reserve a spot. January 2nd. <laughs> January 2nd, the spots open up and they reserve a spot, not on the water, but somewhere in the campground. And then they get here as early as they can in the week and get one of the non-reservable sites. But that way they at least have a backup so that they know that they have a place to stay for sure. But then they will trade it in for a spot on the water once they get here. So number two, I'd have to say how kid friendly this place is. We have four kids. We actually have two of our friends with us. So we have six kids here and um, the rock skipping, rock climbing, rock jumping, rock throwing is just constant entertainment. There is a small playground here. I would say it's fantastic, but um, there was a lot of kids on it. We weren't camped by it, so we didn't really utilize that. There's also a hiking trail that is um, uh, definitely kid friendly for like a toddler, the little loop, but then there's a more challenging loop, which the older kids actually appreciate too. Um, what else for kids? The town is fantastic. Just all in walking distance. Lots of restaurants and uh, great coffee. There's the Java Slow Lab place. And then there's the Donut Shop. Um, another great spot. All the restaurants and all of the water. The food is incredible. Staff is incredible. It's overall a great spot. Oh, there's dogs. Yep, number three friendly. dogs. Yep. <laughs> there's a uh, dog bag stations um, all throughout the park and garbage cans and dumpsters all throughout the park which I greatly appreciate when you're carrying that bag just to have a place to dump it in a timely manner. Um, a lot of dogs here obviously and people have been very respectful keeping them on leashes or tie outs. So number four would be, we should have like talked about this beforehand, um, they do recycle here. That's a huge thing for me. <laughs> I love to recycle and just take care of our earth. So they do have recycling and um, and like I said, dumpsters everywhere, which make it way easier. Um, number five, the sites are super close together. Like really close, but it didn't really seem to matter. Everybody here is in a good mood. So that'd have to be my number five of what's so great about this place. Is that everybody is just happy. People swimming. Ah! It's morning and it's windy. It's chilly. Um, everybody's happy. Like the staff at the campground, in super good moods. Really, really helpful. Just really nice. Um, at all the restaurants, like Josh said, the staff was all very helpful and, and 
friendly and and then the everybody camping is in a great mood and everybody's really talkative we got to know so many wonderful people here that like i said have been coming a long time but also that are new to this like we were so i think that that is it yeah there's great mountain biking at pincushion we're mountain bikers so we love mountain biking as well and uh, just not even a road biking there's quite yep. a bit of just uh good shoulder roads around here mm -hmm. i will uh tell you though but there's a lot of hills so <laughs> don't like hills maybe not the greatest spot you can just ride around town though it's great for riding around yeah. town um, so yeah hope yep. you guys get out here and check out grand marais minnesota it's it's north yeah it's amazing it's like air conditioned all the time it's, like i said it's july and it's beautiful here it's not humid or anything like that because we're close yep. to the lake but if you like warmer you just go up the hill and it gets about 15 degrees yeah just like 10 minutes away from here also there's no mosquitoes down here or yep. very little Freeze. we haven't gotten any bites at all our entire week here it's incredible whereas our kids were in the boundary waters for the week and they are kind of eaten alive but yeah down here with this cool breeze there's it's 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 just we're astounded by the, the lack of mosquitoes. That's great. All right, I hope that you will check out Grand Marais and this wonderful campground, and hopefully this was helpful. Bye.